Hey guys, and we're back with another quick tutorial. Someone asked me the other day if there's a way to get Delphi for free. And yes, yes, there is. There's a way of getting Delphi legitimately for free. So, first of all, you're going to head over to the link in the description. It is the official uh, El Dorado Studios, I believe it's pronounced, page. Um, as you can see, I'm in a VM for this because I already have it installed on my machine and my company's code under my company's registration. So you're going to go over to free tools and down to Delphi Starter Edition. So you're going to click on this. Down the page, down the page. Here, get tool for free. And it's going to prompt you to register. Now I, it's, in, it's actually integral that you use uh, an email address which is valid. They're going to send you your product key via text, uh, via email. Um, I'm not putting my real name in. And I'm going to use a temporary email address. Purely because I'm installing it in a VM. So we're going to head over to Gorilla Mail. We're going to get ourselves a free address. If you're watching this and you've never heard of Gorilla Mail, if you ever want to sign up for something and... You, you're uh, slightly concerned that they might just spam the death out of your email address. There's a really good way around it. So we're going to dump in our temporary email address. We're going to fill in the rest. Mm, this should fill their criteria. So you're going to put a password in. You're going to have to retype your password. I'm not going to put a company name in. It's me. So, not applicable, and phone number will try not applicable, but I'm wagering they put check for numbers. We'll give it a go. So, you're going to come down, and we need to click this. Ooh, not too far. We're going to have to click this at I am not a bot. And you might have to select a sign. So... We're going to hit download, and this is probably going to take a little while. Um, but yeah, you're downloading it straight from the official website. There's no crack needed. There's no jailbreak this. There's no dodgy download that someone's tampered with. Yep, they want to know if there's a number in it. So we're going to fill it with zeros instead. Yeah, that looks about right. So once we've finished our sign up and we've actually managed to get the download to start like so. And yeah, save password. Just for the hell of it. So our download started and this will actually download really quickly because um, if you've ever installed a programming language, they give you like a weird temporary setup thing where it like it will run and it will then install off that. Um, probably to avoid massive downloads. So we're going to hit yes. We want to install. And we're going to click agree. And then we're going to click next. Now a lot of people mess this up by doing this. They click the I don't have key. Use temporary. Right. But like I said a minute ago. Use a valid email address. So you head over to your email address. Like this. And you scroll down, you click on the link. And thank you for downloading the starter version. Scroll all the way to the bottom, and there is your product key. So you copy that, and we go back. And we click the right button, which is I already have product key. It's going to do this. It's going gonna, it's gonna to do this for about th maybe 30 seconds at the most and then it's going to ask us for our product key and there it goes so dump in your product key hit next and it was that simple so yeah um if you've been following my other projects um i don't uh, i probably will put a screenshot in this or maybe not i don't know if the person wants to be in the video or not but someone asked me the other day if this was free and if there was a version that you could get which was free. I currently run the version that my com my company runs. I'm signed in as them. Um, 
Uh, but yes, there is a there is a completely free version. So if you want to join in the project, download the starter version, go get the source code in the, the video that you wanted to carry on with and join in. Um, if you are new to this channel and you have appreciated the fact that I have shown you how to do this, please hit that subscribe button. Um, thanks to the new YouTube changes, uh, subscribers means everything at the minute, so I would be grateful. Uh, with that out of the way, we can see that it's now coming to the end of its preparation for the installer to launch. And yes, I did just say preparation for the installer to launch. What we just went through is some weird setup thing that has to run. Um, so it launches this little download client and give it a second my vm has limited resources and there you go um install delphi 32-bit this is a 32-bit vm if you want a free windows vm check the video out at the end of the description uh, in the description or at the end of the video and i will show you how to get a free windows vm so we're here we here uh we wanted the help files and we wanted the extended pieces um there's also some language options there if you want to install a language now this is going to run for several minutes of just installing. Oh, it's not really installing, it's downloading files in preparation to install. Um, oh, yeah. Well, you can do that and I can cut the video and it goes all the way to the end. So we've got all the way to the end. You've got, you've got a Delphi, in, or you've got a version of Delphi installed. And you click open and this is what you'll see. So it's going to take a few seconds to load. It will tell you that your version is registered and it's registered as starter version. And there you go. You get your choose light or dark. I always go with the light one. Dark makes my eyes hurt. Um, you don't need to fill anything in on this page if you don't need to. So just going to hit next. And I know someone's going to put in the comments if I don't explain this. This doesn't look right. Um, it doesn't look right because I have it in a different mode. So the original mode for Delphi is this, is all floating windows. And that really does my nut in. So we're going to go with the default. And after it will load, it now looks like the version you would have seen in the videos. And it's ready to go. And in a second, I will grab the code and show you it loading so we get rid of them so I've downloaded the source code and I've unpacked the RAR file as you can see it now recognizes the Delphi project files so we're gonna go file and open or just click the open button instead and Browse to our file, browse us through the folders, go to our service, which was our last bit we were working on, and click open, and ta-da! You have your Delphi project open for free. For free using the official software. As you can see, there's no compatibility issues. Um, I don't know if that's going to be permanent, but I will try it in the um, free version before I push it up to um, the website. And... That is pretty much it. You are set to carry on following the videos. You're set. You, you, you just go with it. Um, I don't believe it expires. Please, if someone finds out it expires or it does expire on you, please do comment in the description um, because that would mean, you know, that would mean this whole thing is in, in vain. But as far as I am aware, this is permanently free. Um, I don't see a expires in 30 days or expires in 90 days and I haven't been warned whilst installing it that it would be required that you pay for it at a later date. So there you have it. You have your free version of Delphi from the official company, from the official website. No crack needed, no dodgy install, no bypass login or you know dodgy key gen or anything like that. And you're ready to carry on with the projects so once again guys if you like this video thumbs up please and if you could hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed consider hitting that subscribe button it will be shown at the end of the video
If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. These are two videos you might enjoy. Till next time.